Hey, it is Kid Friday. We do this show because you're a kid in a digital world. I'm Dave. We got 15-year-old Hannah. That's right. She's Hi. been around for 15 years that's super crazy over 15 years over 15 years and as Zoe as Zoe always likes to say she's almost always a year older than she usually is so almost 13 year old Zoe Hi. still not quite yet a teenager but acting like one every day all right so a lot of stuff to talk about uh, new iPads Coming out, the announcement's coming out this next week. We'll tell you our predictions. Big Apple event coming up. I'm going to tell you about, guys, one of the, and I really mean this, one of the coolest ways, j j just because of how it's done, one of the coolest apps I have ever seen, just because of the creativity of it. It's so simple, yet it's awesome. So we'll tell you about that. Uh, we'll also talk about, um, well, you know what? The uh, new Kindle HDX is shipping out with that uh, May Day. Remember the May Day? Uh, that's shipping yeah. out and uh, all, all sorts. I hate to talk about what we're going to talk about. Because, because we don't always talk about it. We, yeah. Like last week I said, mm -hmm. oh, iPhone apps that could pay you. You know, we can still talk about that, but I hate to say that because we may not talk about it, but it's always something going on here. It's Kid Friday. Hello. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Oh! Let's get this party started. Oh, yay, oh, yay. Kid Friday brought to you by Story Cub. And a brand spanking new thing. You can go to storycub.org. And if you have a younger brother, sister, cousin, nephew, niece, little uh, second cousin, Stevie, uh, whatever, personalized stories. You can get a download and DVD very special announcement. It's my story cub and per, you, you can actually get per, a personalized. So you know what, Zoe, you could get the Zoe one and they'll say, Hey, Zoe, the, much better than anything I could ever do. Or, Hey, Hannah, Hannah. And then you'll say, what, what? And they'll say, I've got some stories for you. You know, we've got some good. So it's personalized with your name, not necessarily your name. Could be your cousin's name. Could be your uh, could be the kid at school who doesn't talk too much. Could be that that kid's name. Uh, do you have any uh, kids like that in school in your class? Don't talk too much. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. You know that uh, I heard that uh, Steve Jobs guy didn't talk too much. Did you know how they uh, I saw something today. Well, uh, well uh, about how the, the first mouse was invented, computer mouse. Very interesting, actually. I, I don't know why. I just anyway, go to storycub.org, and you know what? You can watch what do we, what is it? Right? It's video versions of children's picture books. A lot of fun. Great way to discover books. Uh, it is super, super fun. Video versions of children's picture books. That is StoryCub. And you can get the free StoryCub app on iTunes or at the App Store as well as Google Play. Who's chewing? Who's making some noise there on the microphone? What do you got? What do you got? Oh, you got a Jolly Rancher over there, huh, Zoe? It's making a lot of... Yeah, smack the other way, will you? Hmm. All right. Uh, that's the StoryCub. Go to StoryCub.org. Check it out. My StoryCub, as well as the great free video versions of children's picture books. Thank you for sponsoring Kid Friday. <laughs> So, um, I, you know, I saw this a long time ago, uh, but there was this documentary on Steve Jobs, and they were talking about uh, how they uh, got some technology from IBM, blah, blah, blah. So the very first computer mouse, I don't know if you, do you guys remember computer mouses when they used to have a ball on the bottom of them? Yeah. 
and you used to kind of roll them around. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. So um, this guy uh, was talking about how he actually developed for Apple uh, the first computer mouse. And Zoe, I hate that crinkling, crinkling sound. They don't. You just do. So you know what he did? He he went to the drugstore and he mm -hmm. bought he bought a couple different kinds of deodorant, the roll-on. Yeah. You know the roll-on? And they have those that ball? Yeah. Yeah. Like and, a roll-on lip gloss. Exactly. Okay. Is it a roll-on? Oh, is that that round thing? Is that roll-on? Well, no. Like when it's in a tube and then there's a little ball at the top or like perfume. Okay. Yeah. And it spins, right? Yeah. Hey, Zoe, what are you doing? It's kind of melty. It's kind of... Do you need a... Is it a, chewy? Oh. Uh, do you need some barbecue sauce? Because I actually have some over here if you yeah. need that. Okay. All right, there you go. Ew, why is it so big? <laughs> Right. So, they got from <laughs> so, uh, so this guy bought Ew. a couple, a couple different uh, roll-ons uh, with, because um, uh, they were different size balls. And while he was walking around the store, he found a butter dish, and he took the butter dish and he turned it upside down. Mm -hmm. And so he took the ball, and then he took the butter dish, and he, he moved, and that was that's how things start. That's how things get created. It's not necessarily by all this computer CAD, you know, computer aided design and everything. It's got to start the idea. The idea's got to start somewhere. And he started it with, with roll on. Just saying. All right. Cool. I thought it was an interesting story. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, you you want to see a cool app? Sure. Okay. So, uh, uh, and we'll we'll talk about the uh, the Apple event here coming up. We kind of do talk on the Apple side. Although I will say it's interesting the uh, PlayStation PSP the the the, uh, the uh, I'm not I mean the PS3 for well, the first it's time a PS4 or four yeah. PS4 I'm sorry outselling for the first time. As a matter of fact, let me just bring this up because this is a, a, a kind of like a um, <coughs> like 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 a big like the streak is over. Uh, the Xbox 360, which is just you know huge, 32 months or, or two and a half years. That's how long the Xbox 360 has held the number one spot for console uh, systems for gaming in the United States. Well, and, there's not many gaming systems. Well, there's the Wii. You ever heard of the Wii? Wii? The Wii, the, oh, the Wii would like dominated, but you know Wii what? Wii and PlayStation. Like, what else is there? Uh, you know, it takes a while for the data co to come out, but for September. PlayStation 3, number one. Number one. What else is there? Yeah. Look it up. Look it up. Well, just saying. The well, Xbox there's like is, three main things that like, we've all heard of. But, okay, well, but it's like it's like saying uh, the iPhone has been number one forever, and then all of a sudden the HTC One uh, Max. Have you seen this thing, by the way? No. The HTC One Max. They just announced it this past week. I bet it's week. giant. It is a bit. Have you seen the uh, Samsung Note three? No. Um, this is. It's bigger than that. It's the big boy. It is. Can I see it like compared to an iPhone? It is the big, big boy. Like I can't tell. It's just uh, okay, a picture. Yeah, I know. I'll, well, I'll, well, I'll, I'll, I'll see if I can find a comparison. Uh, and uh, let's see if we can. Uh, is there, is there a comparison to an iPhone and an HTC Max? Hmm. Well, I'm not sure. I'm just not sure. But let's just say that it's. I think well, it's like, like 5.9 inches. And it's how big, big is an iPhone? Uh, 4.2 inch screen. It's mm -hmm. big. It's big. It's big. Uh, I think the probably like the best doesn't... example is. Uh, I don't know why this doesn't go in the middle. But okay. So let's just take a quick look at uh, at this picture here. It's this is. Um, you see the guy in, in in the hand there, right? Yeah, it's pretty big, right? Yeah, I don't like big phones because like the point of a phone is to have it be like small, fit in your pocket. Like that would not fit in my pocket. No, it wouldn't, right? Yeah, and so it would fit in my pocket though. Well, I have put I have taken a five inch tablet and put it in my pocket. You well, have small you have big pocket. Well, my pockets barely fit my iPhone five, and um, it's a little too close. And um. What are you doing? I was I was trying to you know it, if like, I had I multiple think, hands I could do a side by side. Like but. my f iPhone is like if it was any bigger it'd be like hard to hold my hand. Like when I'm talking you it's have like small hands. Well yeah some people it's a big. lot of people big. yeah and so I'm just saying like I don't know like I don't think a big phone is a good idea like I wouldn't get any bigger than the iPhone five because then you have like your tablet and like 
most people just like don't want to combine those like that phone is supposed to be like small and portable not not having to carry around like a purse everywhere for well, it. you know a lot of people are saying that apple is making a big mistake by not coming out with a big phone so i i, I don't uh they are. i don't know if they are or not i, like, I, don't, a lot I just of phones. I, mean, I just think if like my phone didn't fit in my pocket like i would not want to all right use it uh, so do you, you know, you know, the, um, iPhone cases, Yeah. right. That for the iPhone five C, yeah. the ones with the holes in them, mm-hmm. right. Mm-hmm. Zoe. So you, you do have to get a different case if you have an iPhone four, uh, or you, well, you have a four S right now. Um, she's talking about five. Yeah. Oh, I'm talking, what did I say? What did I say? Four. Well, the, well oh, she's got a four S now, but I'm saying the new, the new five C. Okay. From Apple, uh, which by the way is now selling for just $45. Believe Where? it or not, uh, let's see. Um, it was you know Walmart. it started at, it started at ninety nine dollars, and then uh, Best Buy uh, did something said sell they're selling it for fifty. Now Radio Shack, Walmart uh, have cut it uh, before because uh, Walmart cut it down to seventy nine. Da 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 da. Last week Walmart slashed it to forty five dollars. Now I think yeah through the holiday season, so you can buy the iPhone five C for forty five dollars. With a two-year plan in the United States, uh, um, th- uh, Radio Shack uh, plans to give customers fifty-dollar gift cards to wait, apply to iPhone okay. 5C phones through November second. So the iPhone 5 and the iPhone 5S, they're the same size, so you can use the same case. But the iPhone 5 or 5S, like if you get a case for that, you can't use it on the 5C. Yeah, yeah, because we saw the curve. Do you have the yeah. pictures that we took at the Apple Store? We never showed those. Do you have them on your phone? Maybe you can uh, just pull up the case. Oh, yeah, I think I do. Hold yeah, on. Yeah, check that out because uh, it has to do with this app that I'm talk- I'm about to show you, okay? And it is strictly on, on, on ingenuity. It wins, to me anyway, the coolest app. Okay. One of the coolest apps I've ever seen, okay? All right. Uh, can I go to, should I go to your uh, camera? Yeah. The, the desk cam here? All okay. right, let's take a look at that. So. And see what. What do you got? What do you got okay. there? Let's so this is comparing um, the iPhone 5s to the iPhone 5, and on the um, the one the, on one, the one on the left, <laughs> the one that's uh, the one on the left here down, right? The one on the left is the five, and the one oh, yeah, on the right yeah. is the 5s. Yeah, the, the one with the the, uh, the cord there is the one in the store. They don't want you to steal, right? Yeah. Yeah. What else you got? Here's another there? picture. Okay. Um, here's the front of it. Hold on. I'm trying to chain. I'm trying to turn it. Okay, well, it doesn't matter. Yeah, here. There you go. Here's the screen. Yeah, so you can see how the home button has been kind of moved a little bit. And although the, the, it's hard to tell, it's, it, it, the screen changed from a 4 inch to a 4.2 inch on, on that. So, so just a little bit. But the, the size didn't change. Yeah. And here's the back again. Now, here's the iPhone 5C compared to the iPhone 5. Mm hmm. Here's a better picture. And here is the um, size difference. Yeah. So do you see? Do you see the roundness there, Zoe? Uh-huh. I told you. Yeah. Yeah. I told you. I'm the one who predicted it. No, I am. Oh. Here's it again. Here's Those the cases. Those cases are stupid. Those cases are so stupid. What is that? Who says that? I'm pretty sure you can still use a five case on it. It's not gonna like be totally like impossible to put all right so check out those cases because this is what we're going to talk about right now so those cases have holes in them white with the white those cases have holes in them so you can see the dots so they should be half price right or you could just buy a case with dots on it all right before i talk about it uh actually we're let's just watch a video okay uh and it does have audio so if you can hear through my uh headphones then you're in good shape if you can't then uh, you can't. Okay? <coughs> Wait, oh, here's the iPod Nanos. Yeah. I mean, yeah, they're the Nanos. Okay. Look at this. What you do with the case. Check it out. You can play Connect 4 by taking the case off the back. Putting it on the front. Is this by Apple? I think so. How cool is that? So 
that is uh, that is awesome. I think that is a great idea. Yeah. It's called Flip Case. And uh, you, don't you think just on coolness alone? Yeah. You know, like that, like that. Like, I didn't think the cases were a good idea, but that makes it, like, seem like yeah, a Yeah, so you take idea. the you take the iPhone 5C case, and you bring it on the front of your, your, your phone. You can play Connect 4 in an interesting way. Game itself, you know, it's not, like, a, a crazy game, but it's just... I, I like how it's, yeah. how it's put together. Uh, I was going to look for it in the App Store. Uh, Probably yeah, costs money. Find it. Uh, but what a, what a, what an interesting... Um, it's oh, right there. Not, it's free. iPhone oh, apps. It's free. Yeah. All right. Let me uh, let me just bring it here. Let me bring right, it. Go get something here. to drink. Yeah. Go get something to drink and uh, throw all your wrappers. Please take your wrappers with you. Thank you for your cooperation. Check this out. So there it is, right there. It's called Flip Case. And it's a really good idea. It is. It yeah, isn't it? I think mm -hmm. that is just just really cool. Really really cool. Look at that. You can play Connect Four, you get four in a row, and win, you can shake to replay. I, I just, you know, you know what I mean? It's just one of those things that, gen genius, huh? Yeah. Hold on, sorry. I knocked ourselves off, or knocked our audio off there for a second. Uh, so just a neat game. So that is Flip Case. And uh, so if you have an iPhone 5C or plan to get one or whatever, um, Wow, what a really, really neat, neat app that uh, that is. So, flip case. All right. So, uh, hey, where's Zoe? She's gone with the wrappers. Uh, you know, someone wrote in and asked what my favorite drink is. I'm not trying to make an endorsement, but I think I need to shake it a little bit. I like this Yoohoo. It's like um, bad. It's like chocolate milk that's not good for you. I don't think it's a good idea to drink. Um like beverages with calories because it's empty calories and even if you drink like diet pop and stuff it um but so I, that empty calories means like there's no benefit to you well i just got done working out this is protein what did he see how much protein's in that no you can tell you let's take a look three grams that's not a lot. You can get more protein in milk. You can get more protein like milk in milk is a, good because it has protein and stuff in it and vitamins well, uh, I learned how to make foam, like foamy milk today. Make what? Foam milk? Foamy. Foamy milk. Yeah. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Was that uh, when I heard mom Steve yelling, yelling, ah, stop the microwave, yeah. stop the microwave. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay, well, so if you get like a mason jar, you, well, you, first, you want like off, the big we, ones. Let's back off for a second. Why are you making this? You, you like this uh, coffee drink, well, whatever, no, right? No, like, I like lattes, but you need steamed milk, but I don't have like a milk steamer, but this works just as good. Okay, so how do you steam So foamy milk? milk, you can like put, put it with coffee or hot chocolate and it's like makes it really frothy and good. Okay, so you can take like a mason jar, like a big one or ball or whatever brand, like this big, mm -hmm. and... If you don't have a cap for it for some reason, I didn't have a cap for it. So, like, you can just, like, put it, put milk in a water bottle and then shake it up for, like, maybe a minute. And then it gets all, like, foamy. And then you pour it into, make sure it's, like, a big jar that's microwave proof that you can put. No, not a bowl. You want something tall. Microwavable. We, yeah, that's microwavable. Yeah. And then you put it in and then it will get like really like foamy and high because it has all this air in it but then when you take it out like some of the foam will go away but there and there'll be like a little bit foam and then you pour it into a mug and you put your whatever you want in it okay yeah. interesting or you could just buy a milk frother from ikea for three bucks hannah's hannah's hitting me up for a, a uh, an espresso yeah. machine yeah. and uh uh, what does a 15-year-old need with an espresso machine? To make drinks. But the, like you, usually a 15-year-old wants, wants uh, like a shaved ice machine or a something one. like that. Uh, you know, we already have something, one. Something like that. All right. Apple is go coming out on the 22nd. When is that? Next? Was that this coming Tuesday? Depending on when you're watching this. But, uh, yeah, Tuesday. So, um you know they had we're coming up to the holiday season right and we're going to be talking about uh all the black friday deals uh coming up on on maybe even as early as next week um 
There's some usually some great deals, huh, Han? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so Apple has a, a big event Actually, coming up. Actually, okay. So like, for, wait, wait. Can I just say something really quick about yeah. Black Friday? So I think Black Friday is good for electronics and stuff. It's good deals. But the clothes and stuff, no. Black Friday started in uh, the United States, but it's spread worldwide. And uh, they have deals in Australia. It's like kind of awkward because there's like nothing around it. Like it's the like, day after Thanksgiving. Like that makes sense for like America because it's Thanksgiving, which is only in America. You know, uh, your mom. It's kind of like random like for, for like people in other countries. Well, no, but it be, be, but the, the fever has spread to other countries. Yeah, I know. But it, I'm just saying it's kind of like a random date for no, them well, because it's not the day after Thanksgiving. Oh, but, well, they call it Black Friday. Do you know why it's called Black Friday? Okay, wait. Be I was watching... Well, hold on, hold on. I was watching Cutthroat Kitchen, which is a really good show. It's on the Food Network. And this lady, like, they have to grab all these groceries, and she's like, it was like Black Thursday in there. <laughs> and I'm like... Black Thursday. Black Friday. I mean, mean it starts at midnight, but mi midnight is Friday. Like our, that's, our, it doesn't really start before that unless it's like toys are. I wasn't even going to look, but the ads are already starting to leak. By the way, Black Friday is you know is when the the stores say they they're fine they're in the black, which means they're 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 you know that for the rest of the year they're actually going to be making profits. They'll be profitable, um, hopefully. Uh, so black just just out of curiosity because uh, the Black Friday ads are starting to leak and let's see according to W R A L even though Black Friday is still over a month of a month away get the, 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 uh oh Macy's oh so uh so like okay Macy's. like for example Target for example toy a store posted. I like is Macy's. American Apparel and their Black Friday Cyber Monday deals are like twenty percent off your entire purchase. Mm -hmm. A few weeks ago, I ordered some stuff from them. 30% off. You just have to watch these stores that you like, and you'll get better deals. Like, I remember, like, Juicy last year, you got $20 off your purchase of whatever you want. So we got a sweatshirt for f literally $5, brand new, at the Juicy store. $5. And, and, and you had to give them a phone number to text, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I'm still getting texts from them. Yeah, and me too, I and I'm trying to cancel. And uh, it doesn't, and I keep getting text messages from Juicy Couture, and I have no interest in that. But let's check this out. Hey, seriously, just literally, just But just, I'm just like just saying, release. like, some well, places are good, like, but you should just watch for other deals because Black Friday is not, they're not the Electronics, though, hey, check this out. It's like Black, not worth it. Uh, Battlefield 4 for PS3, uh, Xbox What's 60. What's Battlefield 4? It's a big game. PS3, Xbox 60, or PC. Uh, I thought it was Grand Theft Auto it's, was the big one. It Okay, well, that is a big one, too. That's, that is much bigger. I've but, never uh, heard of Battlefield. I've heard of it's half Call off. of Duty and stuff. Okay, all right. Uh, PlayStation we'll Plus, like PlayStation Plus membership at GameStop normally fifty dollars, twenty nine ninety nine. Nintendo three DS uh, bundle for two nineteen. Uh, so that is a so the GameStop Black Friday ad. It's, it's so like some places released. are good that usually don't have sales. They have an Xbox. So on Black Friday, better. GameStop is going to have an Xbox 360 250 gig bundle for one ninety nine, and that is on Friday only. By the way, Macy's. Speaking of Macy's, for the first time ever, all stores are going to be opening up at midnight. Uh, uh, no, I mean, um, I don't like Black Macy's. Friday. We're talking about Black Friday. I was talking to a, I was talking to a friend of mine, uh, who uh, Black Fridays. Who's a manager at a Macy's? She was telling me that. Um. Uh, I went to Mall of America last year for Black Friday. Just Dance 2014 on Black Friday only, 1999. That's, that's a good, pretty good. That's a good deal. For I PS3, think. Xbox, it's normally 360. 40? 30. It's normally it's uh, 39.99. Yeah, oh, so 1999. Yeah, that's 1999. So that's at that's at uh, GameStop. I think like so. games and electronics are better deals. But then, like clothes and stuff, oh, and you can find better deals like other times. times. So a lot of tablets are going to be coming out on Black Friday, and all I can say is this: in all sincerity, be careful what you get. Uh, just don't let price drive you. I, I'm, I see that GameStop is going to have a seven-inch uh, Android tablet for sixty-nine ninety-nine. I bought a tablet. Um, you know, I'm testing out some tablets. I'll just pull it up here. It's actually it's not a bad tablet. I it's, like your Wahoo. Thank you. My Wahoo. It's Yahoo. Uh, Wahoo. <laughs> we were at, um, where were we? Byerly's. 
And I was like, oh, that's dad's favorite drink. And she was like, no, it's not. Because I thought you liked the, like, um, was it Nesquik or something? Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, so I bought, I believe this is the one. I don't know if this is the new one or not. But I bought this uh, seven-inch tablet for $59 on Amazon. How do you do that? Well, I, cool. I search on Amazon. Wait, did you, did you and then I, uh, yeah. I look it up. You and then I, I uh, find it. Oh, you so, weren't asking okay, me. Okay, watch. Wait. No, no, watch. See how much there's like, okay, there was this much water. She j- did one sip and it was to here. Now do another sip and have it be gone. Chug it, 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 chug it. No, no, don't talk, don't talk. Ready, set, go. Don't, you can't make No, you can't disturb me. You have to be quiet. all out all over these fancy microphones. She's going to be spraying water. <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> two. Wow. Wow. Two sips. Wow. Well, I mean, not wow, a sip, but two. Wow. Wow. And look who we got. <laughs> we got a. Where did he go? It's it's none other than the pooch cam. Hey, there's our that poochie who is. I found him. I, I have a remote camera in another room. And there there's a. Uh, He's, I don't know if it's like he's waiting in the green room to come to come into the studio. Like he's gonna be the next guest or something, huh? Yeah. Do you have any tray? Like in like, in like be... the shows, they like wait. In yeah, the exactly. Stage. Right. That's where. That's what it looks like. He is, <laughs> and he, there should be a little tray. Now he's ready to go. There should be a little tray of treats. You should he's have. Getting ready to go. He has to stretch. You should have some refreshments <laughs> there or something. Go. Yeah, he's stretching it out, getting ready. Hey, you're on after the commercial break, right? He's getting ready to go on after the commercial break. So there he is. Shaking it out, making sure he looks all pretty to to come on Kid Friday. All right, Mr. Poochie from Dang, the Pooch Cam. Like all right, Poochie Woochie. Do you want to know something funny? What? Do you want to know something funny? Okay, so I was in a movie today. So I was watching this lady walk, and she had like five pops and a little like one of those container things. And what then she bam, is? drops them all, and they all, they all spray everywhere because all the tops came off. And then she just walks away. Like, not like, she's just like... Like you know those hold those cup holder that cardboard ones that yeah. you get at like fast food restaurants. Yeah, it broke. Yeah. Hey, you want to yeah, talk about? Just, co- just spits See, open. It's See. expensive. Pop it. Movie theaters is like five bucks. You know what? You want to talk about about containers and and food and con- all this and that, right? You want to check this out? This is talk about genius. We thought that that uh, that app flip case was pretty pretty mm. ingenious. Yes. Uh, any comments out there? I have a really good app suggestion. It is, I don't have my phone right now because it's charging. Well, hold on. I'm, I'm talking about something. I'm talking about <sighs> this, my friend. This. Oh, that's not it. Hold on. That's not what I'm talking about. <laughs> talking about this, my friend. Look at that. They don't even have those anymore here. Yes, they do. What they is don't. it? It just came out. It is called the KFC. Believe it or not. What's it it's, called? It's called the Go Cup. What it's does a it Go have? Cup. And it, you're seeing the larger portion of it, but then it skinnies down to fit in your cup holder in oh your God. car lazy, so you can lazy, jam everything fat in there you can jam every it's called the go cup a container that houses chicken and fries and fits in your cups car holder uh, at least uh, they say it'll fit into 83 percent of cup holders out there that's according that's according to usa today <laughs> I, I don't know if i'm i don't know, went around all testing right. it out all right do you want to hear my complaint about this KFC go cup portion snack size. Okay, so you don't get a big. It's not a giant thing. They're they're, they're only they're only like a cu- cu- couple bucks. So oh, it's a snack size. Yeah, it's it's a small thing. Excuse me. Uh, you but get it has like, a sandwich and and fries. Get, well, you get like two. You, yeah, you can get. What's well, a small sandwich? A chicken. Li- they call All it right, the chicken people little. People are getting lazy. Chicken little. They call it. In fact. Yeah. <coughs> they're eating <coughs> their chicken while they drive. <sighs> don't Excuse go to me. Kentucky Fried Chicken. Okay, so. There's this app called the Stress fries Check. Good, no, hold on. I'm, I'm not done with this shit. Oh, yet, my so. God. I'm not done you with the... Uh, that's it. They, they don't have KFC here anymore. I yeah, know they do. A, no, they don't. They closed all of them. No, they did not. Yeah, I actually they think closed, they kind of did. They closed them and changed them into Popeyes. Oh, did they? Yeah, I actually think they did. Yes, they did. Because I, I think we drove past one that used to be a Kentucky Fried Chicken today, and it and it's, like, gone. They either deleted them, 
Deleted them. Um, let let me look up. Look at this. Let's show you this real quick. Boom. Popeyes is better than Popeyes. Boom. Popeyes has this healthy chicken, and it's not. Well, well I can tell you this. It's this I fried. actually hap- This I actually happen to know and that. It's good. Um, and they have fries. Uh, Popeyes or K- KFC. It's owned by the Yum Corporation. They own Pizza Hut, and they also own Taco Pizza Bell. Pizza Hut is not good. I like I like Domino's better. Okay. Look, um, KFC was one of the first into China. You go to China. They are KFCs everywhere. I'm just saying. Fake KFCs. They're real ones and fake ones. Let's talk. Apple coming up Tuesday, October 22nd. That is this coming Tuesday. If <laughs> yeah, you're watching this wait, before, there, there's like, or uh, it already happened, they and we'll closed. talk about it. Most uh, of them, there's like four left in Minnesota. What? Uh, really? Yeah. When did this happen? Um, I, don't I don't know. I just remember somebody saying that they were like closing them, and then I like drove past one that used to be Kentucky Fried Chicken today, and it wasn't closed. Yeah, well, what are you doing? Um, oh, this is from last year. I put some water wow. in my eye. From it last can't. year, they're Whoa. talking about Dang. all of them. Dang. Why Popeyes oh, is buying b- up bankrupt KFC restaurants. Oh, okay, I like the like healthy whatever. chicken. They're um, Popeyes. Uh, they're it's they're franchised. Really they're, they're, so these franchisees are selling off their KFCs and they're turning them to. Okay, can we talk? Can we talk? We never the, really I have to do my app recommendations real quick. We're going to talk about the brand new iPad fifth generation, right after we hear. Okay, thank you. That's from how we Zoe hear. Margo so, Fargo. What do you got? I so, give this I give this credit to Dr. Oz because he is so generous and told me about it. So it's called Stress Check. He so, and who? Is it one word? Doctor Stress. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Go ahead, tell us about yeah. it. Okay, so what you do is you put your um like finger on the home button. And it scans your finger like it's your only pulse and for stuff. Zoe. It's only for the five S, probably. No, well, it happened. It works for me. It just it, it came out a long time ago. Well, it'll tell you what it's good for. It it it, it tells you. It says it's uh, it, uh here. We'll see. Uh, it says requires iOS four point three or later, so it's compatible with iPhone, uh-huh. iPad, iPod Touch. Yeah. Told you. And so, it like senses your pulse and stuff. And then it says, like, if you're very stressed or anything, but it takes, like, two minutes, so it's kind of, like, long. Wouldn't you know but if you're stressed? Whatever, shut up. I bet you I, I bet you are more interested in KFC than this. And I'm then, in a stress management <laughs> class right now. I am enrolled true. in it. I go to it a half, an hour and a half every day. Well, at least I have friends. Oh, this is just getting mean and nasty here in but Studio look at this. 1A. So what, what at is, least I have a good education <laughs> and I get does, good grades. Does it tell you how to relax? Because when I'm with you two, I no. need I my stress needs to get tested. Uh, stress test. Okay. You know what I was really Check. mad about? Hey. So I went to the orthodontist Hannah, today Hannah. and next ray and they made me take out my earrings and Hannah, it really it's bad. Just so you know, all you all you have to say to Zoe is, you think Moscow is in Africa. <laughs> okay, that's all you have to say, Ham. Where is okay. Moscow, though? It's in Africa. Guess, it's in guess. Africa. Where is it besides England? Africa? What school do you go to? What are you? I in, go to are you enrolled? Elementary in Elementary school? school? No, I'm kidding. I don't go to are you enrolled school. in school? I don't know. Ask yourself. You're the dad. Is, is hold on. Oh. Did I, is this a, is this the same one, Zoe? Sizzle. Is this the same one, or do is it different? You, no. No, it's, it's stress like check. Oh, check. I, I did. I, I went. Okay. Stress. Ooh, check. kill him. Okay. I'm going to get it while we talk about the new. Let's let's talk about the real stuff here. Okay. Look at that beauty, my friend. It looks nothing different than the oh iPad right gosh. now. Oh, my gosh. All right. Oh what can they possibly. Oh, my gosh. Add? All right. Okay. My thoughts. I think this is going to be like the 5 S. how the 5 S didn't change that much. I mean, the home button changed. I like the 5 S. I wouldn't get it, though, because it's like. You're paying extra for just like a faster processor and the fancy home button. Well, as new um, as new games come out, you know, that, so this new i, you know, this new iPad is going to have the A7 chip in it, same chip as the uh, iPhone 5s, and so uh, developers are going to be able to make uh, cooler games and all yeah, that it's just stuff. Yeah, going to be faster. Uh, so, but it's, but a lot of them aren't available yet either. So um, you have to remember that as well. Uh, so sorry, I'm. Putting in my, uh, I'm getting stress tests right, stress check really? right now because I'm s- stressing out. Uh, okay, all right. It takes so, a while, so you might does it? Be I mean, it says it takes two oh, minutes. Okay, I'm getting it anyway. All right, so here's what here's here's what here's what we're looking at. Okay, so they sent out invitations. Uh, big deal. Boo hoo hoo ha ha. I we here at Kid Friday, um, not surprisingly, did not receive an invitation unless Hannah, you're holding out and you got to. 
you know, I thought we were going to be on our way to San Francisco next week for this uh, this whole deal. And I wish because we were there right now. The big, the big, what I was getting at earlier, the big holiday season's coming up, right? I have a right? there right now, actually. Apple's got to announce all their new stuff. I like how, you know, uh, around you know, Black Friday and all that, you can go in there and you can, uh, they have it all wrapped up for you. So you can buy it wrapped. So, okay. So the iPad 4. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. The last I- iPad arrived six, just six months after the third generation. And then they, they just, you know, they don't call it the iPad. They just call it the iPad, right? Or iPad with retina, right? Or whatever. Um, and so what we're, what we're coming down to is this. The uh, iPad, same 9.7 inch retina display. Zoe, what are you doing over there? What are you, what are you doing? It's like making... I don't, all right. Uh, but the thing is, is that they slimmed it down to match the thickness of the current iPad mini. That's pretty thin. That's pretty darn thin. Yes, and, it uh, is. I don't know how thin It's got iPad mini little different thin. edges, and a reflective Apple logo can be seen in recent pl- products are visible. So you know how, uh, like on the MacBooks, you know how the Apple lights up on yeah. the back? Oh, that's cool. Yeah, we, we might, we might be see seeing that. Oh, we that's... might be seeing that. Uh, and then, uh, uh, you know, expect it to have that A7 chip. That's a 64-bit, okay? So if you're a gamer, you know, what? that's really the Well, people the good don't stuff really game on the iPad, I'd say. Well, a lot of, it's, yes, I'd, I'd say you're wrong. Not major, not major. It's a lot of, I'd, I'd say you're wrong, my angry bird friend. Uh, angry bird, it's not gaming. It's, as far as I'm concerned, it is. Uh, well, I'm talking about, like, hardcore I know. gaming. No, but, I know. Gaming's, like, um, Grand Theft Thief. So so here's the deal. Here's the deal on storage. I'm always running out on storage. So Apple, uh, they may stick to their 3264 128 gig thing. The the introduction of a 256 gig model, though, uh, the way technology is going with the solid so. state hard drives, may not be out of the question. Because I think primarily people don't use their iPad for work. I mean, yeah, yeah, they might. But you use a computer for work. It'd be really hard for you to use an iPad, I think, like by itself. And so um, I don't think they do it with that much because like most people just buy 32 gig and it's like enough for them because they just use it to like go on the computer and just play some games. And And of course you have cloud storage. So, uh, you know, that's, you know, as we, but we're still kind of in that, you know, the kind of. But like, I don't think you really save that much on your eye. Just um, to look and like check stuff it's fully expected to have the touch id like the iphone 5s so you know the fingerprint identification yeah. uh, on that so uh so we're gonna look for that and um uh who knows who knows so uh, yeah any questions out in the audience yeah. The, yeah the girl uh down in front with the uh, scratching of the neck yes so you do remember the olden days i bet hannah does it <laughs> but sure? you should so what, stain old? Zoe? I never seen that. What olden days you thought? I don't know what that's about. All from. right, come on. Chop, oh, okay, chop. and so so you know when the iPad one came out? Yeah, absolutely. And you know how the side of it was like was like different than the iPad now? It was sure. like the iPhone 5. Sure, it, yeah. was, it was thicker. Yeah. It, was, it was thicker it was and it was rounded. It was more curved. It had, yeah. no, it had like a side to it. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, because and and as as technology gets, uh, it, it, devices can get smaller. Too. They can get smaller. I, I like them bigger, but they can get smaller because of uh, the way we're uh, progressing here. Uh, and um, I was actually wondering, what is the screen made out of? The screen. Glass. Glass? No, but like. Like how they do they make it, the the they, things like colorful and stuff? They, well, they, well, first off, the glass they call it Gorilla Glass, and I believe it's made mm. by a company actually in Tennessee. Uh, and then they, I think they ship it over to to, to Foxconn over in you know, Shenzhen. <laughs> but um, how do they make the retina? The the uh, it's a retina how do they make it, the display. Retina screen? That's, yeah. all, that's all. That's a whole nother conversation, no! my friend. Oh, Studio 1A is she getting... She was getting me wet. Oh. There's a water bottle, Zoe. Oh, round two. Ow. All right, I think it's a good time right now for us to maybe talk about the iPad. Um, see, we talked about the iPad. That, you know, the, there's only been one version of the iPad mini, so a new one should be coming out. And what do you think about the iPad? Uh, the the 
the everyone's saying that the iPad Mini is going to outsell the regular iPad. And uh, well, what do you what do you think it's going to have? Any anybody? Even, who knows? Is it, are they going to bring the price down? That's what they should do, huh? Do you think it's going to have the A6 processor? meaning it won't uh, be the 64-bit high-tech gaming uh, kind of device. But uh, a lot of people think, just like the iPhone, the iPad could come in colors. The iPad mini, that is, could come in colors. All right. Uh, we are, it's, uh, let's just also mention to, some things to look out for. Uh, the new iPods, uh, you know, holiday season's coming up. I don't know who's buying iPods anymore, iPod touches, uh, but uh, they might. So, uh, you know, there it is right there, the big iPod touch. Uh, they'll probably, who knows, lower the price. Why don't you lower the price? Maybe you'll sell some. And... Um, a new Mac Pro they'll probably announce finally, and uh, which is still going to cost a ton of money. But uh, and maybe Apple TV, a new Apple TV, probably not an Apple Television, and unfortunately, probably not a watch. That's kind of well, a lot of what I've been reading is that uh, what's going on there. So all right, now um, because of a certain circumstances uh, beyond my control. Uh, we're going to have to cut this Kid Friday short, but I swear I had, oh, this Kindle Fire HDX. Let's just watch this video real quick because uh, if you haven't seen this, uh, the tablet comes with its own May Day button and it can yeah, actually, I've seen that. yeah, We've it can. Seen the commercials. I know, I know, but it, it's just. It freaks me out that someone on the other end that can yeah, actually like uh, that help idea. you. Of course, your biggest problem is going to be you can't get onto Wi-Fi. So because you can't get onto Wi-Fi, you can't you can't yeah. get get the May Day button working. But let's just check this out. I think it's kind of neat. May Day. Thank you for pressing the Mayday button. How can I help you? Whoa, who are you? <laughs> I'm Amy, a tech advisor for your new Kindle Fire. I didn't realize I get a live person. Yep, we're here 24 seven. We can draw on your screen and even show you how to use different features. So I can just press the Mayday button and you're here to help? Hit Mayday and I'm coming to the rescue. Amy, I like you. Aw. <laughs> Introducing the revolutionary Mayday button, only on the new Kindle Fire HDX. So there you go. That is uh, the Mayday button on uh, the. Uh, that's that's a good gimmick. I like that. I like that. that I think uh, a lot of grandmas and grandpas are going to get the Kindle. I think it's that button. Yeah, I think it's turning into the grandma grandpa. Like you know, kids. It's it's the iPad, right? But look out. Oh, I was going to say these Android tablets. Okay, there's going to be. You're going to see prices just crazy. And there are um, some good ones, and uh, you know that will actually work and function pretty well. Uh, but there's also going to be a, like a lot of junk out there. So uh, you know, maybe we'll help you as we get closer to Black Friday, and you know, we'll take a look at the operating systems that they have because there's going to be 59. You know, we already mentioned what 69 dollar tablets. I bought one for 59. Uh, the prices are really coming down, but man, it, it stinks to get something uh, at a good price, but that doesn't work so well. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, all right, this is a There's like no point in getting it then. Well, yeah, there, there isn't, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, it, well, unless you want to use it for, I don't know, you know, sometimes, you for know, an, an Twitter extra, accounts. An ex, for what? You don't want to buy something expensive and have it go bad if you're going to hack someone's Twitter account. Is that what you do? You hack Twitter accounts? No, but if you're going to hack a Twitter account, how do you, how do you, you have to use a computer that you're never going to use again after it. How do you How do you hack a you Twitter account? You have to account? download some dumb software. Where'd you hear this? Or did you read it? Or mm, just hack Don't it. hack. Don't hack. Don't no, hack. don't do Do not do it because it will ruin your computer and it will be bad. No hack. One final thing, Hannah, because I think it's very important because you love this subject. Uh, Sony, look at that. They launched it. It's out there. It's the SmartWatch 2, and it is available right now in the U.S. of A. It is the, There's a SmartWatch 2, the Xperia Z Ultra Fablet, and Xperia Z1 Smartphone all available in the U.S. right now. So you got the watch, you got the tablet, you got the phone. Smartwatch 2 uh, was first introduced in June in China, and uh, it's supposed to have a uh, three- to four-day battery life. Who uses a Sony smartphone? It supports NFC for easy pairing with Android 
4.0 plus smartphones. Oh. So that's smart that they it's not just a Sony phone, yeah, right? Yeah, because nobody has Sony phones. Like Samsung just did. They released their Samsung watch, and it only works with Samsung phones, not Android. So at least this one is uh, more Android compatible, and it's also cheaper. It retails for $199. No. And I'm putting that on my list if I had an Android phone. I think that's phone. expensive. If I had an Android phone. Uh well, I like a nice watch. It's a good looking. It's actually a good looking watch. No, you know. It's not. What if it had a pink uh, band on it? Would that I don't would like it help? Pink. Would that help? No, it would not. It wouldn't help. It's got an eight megapixel. Oh, I'm sorry. No, that that one that doesn't. The uh, ec- the uh, Xperior does, uh, Z does. So, but look at that. I like that. 199 bucks. All right. This is a 2013 Kid Friday production, all rights reserved. Uh, don't call us, we'll call you, but we do want you to write into us, and we would love to read your email right here. Just go to kidfriday.com and click on, there's a link right there, write to us, write to us, because we're going to have listener email no matter where you are in the world, and then Kid Friday's being viewed in over 200 countries, write into us. And we would love to hear from you. We really would. We're, we're, we promise we're getting back into the whole email game. And I'd love to hear your questions, comments, critiques. Uh, well, like, you know, whatever. All right? You guys, uh, you guys, what about our guest in the green room? We left him hanging. We left him hanging in the green room. I don't even know where he is. All right. Well, we'll see you next time on Kid no Friday. We always like to open with the beginning, so we'll see ya. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Oh! Let's get this party started.